Hello, hello, and welcome to this year's New Year's video. In February. I'm just going to cut for the chase here. We've, we've had to record this video, we've had to re-record this video twice now. This is the third time I'm recording this, and I'm sick of it. So, we're just going to cut to the chase. On the last day of each year, we do a New Year's video. Just to go over what happened this year, what's going to happen next year, what our plans are. Any plans we have, and... I would just be talking to the camera, unscripted. Through Pickles, the cow puppet. And that would be it for the year. This year, we didn't do that. Because, I'll be honest with you, I did not know what to say on New Year's Eve this year. So I just decided to make a quick montage video of our videos this year. And that was it. So here we are now. We're doing it in a slightly different format in February. And there is a little bit to talk about this time. Because last year, 2021, was an experimental year for the channel. We tried some new stuff. We were seeing what worked and what didn't. So, we're going to take a look at what we did to start with. So we're going to take a look at what we did last year and talk about it. So yeah, year in review. Let's go. The first video we did last year was a video of a glitch we found in the Sonic 1 prototype, which was revealed on the day that we were actually making the news video. We were editing it. That's all. Oh, there's a hidden power stream. I might watch it while we're editing. And yeah. That happened. And then we did the Among Us meme. Among Us. I don't like to jump on the man wagon that much, but we did it this time. And also the Bit Wars meme. Because everyone kept missing the punchline. The risk game part was the punchline. But instead everyone just did it like as a blah 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 or something like that, anyway. Lost in translation. Then we did the the bacon video, puppet videos, the ritual for National Scamp Day. Which is February 27th, by the way. Note that down in your diary. And another puppet video. We started doing YouTube poop music videos last year. We also got back into Angry Birds around this time. More puppet videos. Yeah, that Angry Birds glitch we found. And the Lost commercial. For the Lost Angry Birds game. We found that. And then YouTube poops. Interestingly, you might see there's a difference in quality with the jokes before and after the Bolt one, because with Thomas you can just do... you can just rely on sentence mixing for the jokes, but with Bolt you couldn't do that, so it was kind of a stretch for me, see what I could do. And that carried over into the next one we did, which is James Discovers Deviant Art. Yeah. Between that, we also uploaded something about the 4th anniversary video, which I will get to in more detail later. We had some memes, another YouTube poop, more memes. And then it went quiet for a little bit, and I'll explain that. It's because I went down to the coast again, went down to Woolmouth. And when I came back, I was I was only there for about two days. And when I came back I was shattered. So I took a little bit of a break. And also I was getting ideas because I wasn't really sure where to go with YouTube. So I was editing the Bournemouth video, which I uploaded later, and I was trying to think of what to do next. And then we did the YouTube poop music video of Sonic 4, which I, I got back into the Sonic around this time as well. Yeah, we did the SF animation, which, judging from the feedback, judging from the response, I don't think we'll be doing more anytime soon. Also has 69 views right now, so yeah. <laughs> Maybe not, well, we'll see. And then we did the, the holiday video that year. And then we did the Knuckles video, which was uploaded, I think, on the day that the green screens came out. And then Full Circle, another Sonic 1 glitch. And then the New Year's montage that I talked about earlier. And that was it for 2021. So we've all out of the way. Let's talk about what's going to happen this year. Which is going to be a little bit easier than in previous years, because this year we have actually already uploaded some videos 
so we don't to talk about. So, first of all, I'm sure you might have noticed by now that my channel is named after a Chuck E. Cheese character. Chuck E. Cheese does not exist where I live, which means it's kind of hard to make videos about it. Even though we have done so a few times in the past, and we have succeeded, mainly with that cursed images video that got really popular around the time they went bankrupt, got called in the algorithm. And I think that is how I ended up with most of my subscribers, I'll be honest. Also, yes, I know some of the pictures are showbiz, not Chuck E. Cheese. Which is why I made a comment addressing that and pinned it. But then YouTube decided to screw up the comments on mobile, so some people don't actually see that comment. Yeah. This year you might see some more Chuck E. Cheese stuff, Chuck E. Cheese related stuff. Like, mm, mainly probably highlights from the old Pizza Time Fear Theory show tapes, the ones from the early 80s. You know, back when Chuck was really aggressive towards the others, I'll be honest. Um, yeah, you'll see some more Chuck E. Cheese stuff, more animatronic stuff in general, so that's Showbiz, Book Fire Explosion, and even FNAF. Puppets. A lot of you might remember that puppets are basically my legacy on YouTube. My first few videos from 2017 were puppet videos. That is how I got started on the internet. Even though I don't do many of them nowadays, and there is a very good reason for that. Some of the puppets that I used to use a lot in videos, like even Pavlov himself, the dog, they aren't in the best condition right now. Another reason is it's kind of hard to come up with ideas for skits. So, I mean, I do miss making puppet videos, they're fun to make. I crept myself up a few times. Yeah, I want to do them again this year. I might start doing them again. Also, the fourth anniversary video that I was talking about earlier. That was a remaster of Puppets Do Stuff. One of my first videos from day one. And even after delaying it so I could actually finish it, I still wasn't happy with the final product, so I took it down. And hopefully this year, for my fifth anniversary, yes, fifth anniversary, you will uh, see take two of Puppets Do Stuff Remastered, along with all the others, including the, basically everything in that, in that playlist is going to get remastered. VR Chat. What a video game. <laughs> Some of you might remember, I used to have quite a few VR Chat videos. I didn't take them down, I privated them. Mainly because I, they weren't really that good. In retrospective. Not because of the content in the video itself, even though you might have forgotten to censor a couple of things in some of them. It's mainly because they were edited in iMovie. Yeah. Also, I forgot to mention earlier, all of my older stuff from the early years was edited in iMovie, mobile or desktop. Although, since the beginning of last year, we've started editing with Vegas. You can do a lot more in Vegas than you could in iMovie. Anyway, so yeah, we took down the old VR chat videos, and you might have seen already, a couple of them are already back up. We're using some old clips and new clips, and hopefully when all the old stuff is back up, you might see some brand new videos. Because I do miss playing VR chat. We had some good times there. Good times. You, know, you, you, might, you might also see some VR chat videos that don't feature me. Might see some highlights of other VR chat players. So look out for those. YouTube poops and YouTube poop music videos. I started doing those around the end of year before last. I hope to keep on doing them. But the trouble is sometimes the jokes don't really seem that good when you look back on them. And I think there was one that we actually unlisted because aside from one or two jokes, the rest of them they were tail or miss. That was the Stepney one, I think. So, hopefully that'll be back up this year. And also, I think we have two or three new YouTube poops in the works already. So, hopefully we'll see those sometime later this year. YTPMVs, they're a little bit hard to make because, well, obviously, you have to do the pitch shifting. But hopefully you'll see more of those as well. Random stuff, you'll obviously see some random stuff that doesn't really fit with anything I've just said. Like memes or... Other stuff like 
um, Sonic. I'm sure you might have noticed by now that the background video is Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Um, yeah, memes, Sonic, yeah, FNAF, as I've already said. And I think that is everything I have to say about that for now. So yeah, I think that's everything I have to say for now. If I've missed out anything, I will leave it in the comments. Um, let me tell you now, I was hoping to get this video out, I think, in the middle of January. And here we are, one month later. Still working on it. <laughs> um... So, like I said before, I do ad lib these basically. This one especially. This was mostly ad lib. But um, yeah, hopefully you're still here. Hopefully you haven't fallen asleep or clicked off because of my nonsensical rambling about puppets and Chuck E. Cheese. Um, yeah, like I said before, if I have missed anything, I will leave it in the comments. Um, yeah. Also, shout out to that random guy who asked for a shout out, by the way. I don't know if you're watching right now, but that random guy I actually met in person the other day. He asked for a shout out. I can't remember your name for my life, but um, here you go. Ah! There you go. That was a shout out. A little shout out. <laughs> and to the rest of you, you know who you are. So whatever you're here for, thanks for sticking around. Thanks for watching. And as all the cool YouTubers say, hopefully I will see you in the next video.